This um, meeting today is partly about to introduce to you a little bit what we plan to do. Changing the way that we do politics, so uh, making uh, politics more transparent and offering new venues for participation. But what is more important is to listen to you that what do you think, uh, what should we do in, uh, in the European Parliament. We would like to see the European Parliament become the central piece of accountability at the European level so that it can, it can oversight all the activities of the European Union on behalf of European citizens. Transparency is of course a prerequisite for uh, having informed and enlightened citizens, but we also really need innovative uh, processes of participation and true political commitment to make these work. My wish uh, would reflect what my colleague here said about transparency in the Council. Um, I think that's an area where there's definitely a lot of space for, uh, for progress. In such a digitalized world, we have the means through uh, digital tools to make democracy much more efficient. I would wish for more uh, and complete transparency within the legislative process, at least uh, in the European Parliament. At the moment, citizens and NGOs do not have access to the EU courts to challenge the decisions of EU institutions. And we'd like to see, firstly, the European Parliament adopt a strong position we share the information with the NGOs in three different uh, working groups. One is on anti-corruption, the second is on lobbying and the third in participation and, and transparency to collect their ideas, their proposals, to plan together how we will work in 2016. thing that comes to your mind. Um, I hope to be open and accessible and I hope that we can really work and together as and transparent. <laughs>